Hey guys, Waller D here. We're back for more uh, adventure, uh, super adventure island dude. I can't forget that. All right, all right. So we cleared. Th this place sucks. We no already know that there's nothing of value over there. All right. So and we also got the crystal sword, which will probably kick a lot of ass. Probably kill all these enemies in this place in a couple of hits. All right. So let's see. Gotta do this crap again. All right. So which one's the best exit here? Left, right, left, right. Hmm. Let's try this one. Damn it! Okay, so. Well, I find a better exit. Hopefully, very soon we will. Um, let's see. We will basically speed up when we get to that far enough. That may be that far. So, well, I'll speed up for you guys. Yeah, this place is just awful. Seriously. Like, what the hell are the greatest things in this place? It's like, hmm, we'll just have dump trial error time. What a great way to make a dump lazy dungeon. Yep. So great, man. Okay, but. The game as a whole isn't too bad. It's just this area that blows. See? Can we. I don't know. That place will not be worthless. Hopefully, we can find a non worthless exit, though. Jeez. That was quite my asshole. Alright, so let's see. More of this action. Yes. Yeah. Place useful. Oh, this is good. Oh, this is great. Kick ass. All right, that was definitely worth it. All right, so second, so just to let you guys know, ah, fuck you, snake. Ah, fuck you, snake. Get a fucking life, sir. All right, might as well just make you use this. Well, uh, looks like he's second part, but make a note. Okay, this is worthless, so I'm gonna take this path. This that uh, the block, the down jab, the block door, and the door on the right will have a shovel bunch of those doors. The rest suck, which is just one, frankly. And I'm certainly sure that there's something good over here. I'm guessing the down jab might have shit. Okay, so after having all that crap happen, yep, this is definitely leading me someplace good. I hope. Yep, this is the way out of here for the moment. Of course, I have to get ambushed by this fucker. Yep. Oh, nice. Two, just two sword sw swings. That's pretty awesome. Oh, fuck you, sw you damn flying bat-like guys. Okay, let's see what we got here. Oh, we're making quite a bit of progress going up this tower. Thank you, asshole bat. Okay, we want to go in the door again. Ah, oh, sweet. Finally can get this thing over here. Alright, so we use Higgins to kick some ass. I'll jab this real quick. Use this block to get up here, and we get 200 fucking coins. 2,000 coins, jeez. Oh, a little bastard. Okay, so clearly it looks like we found all the doors that matter. Where would this lead me? Hmm. Should we go back to uh, an older area, guys? Let's at least see where it leads us. It leads us to Puka, Puka Puka Island, and we don't really need to do that yet. Alright. So we're gonna go back to a more inter or more important area. Too bad I have to fucking get that block again, which is pretty damn annoying. Damn. Oh well, at least we know which door it is now. Third, third, uh, furthest left, and then down, down left, or just shovel through blocks and yeah, you get the idea. Okay. So. Yeah, basically, I guess the 50 exits seem more like 12. But this place still has quite a fucking annoyance about it. And I mean, why the fuck would you just lazily put, like, two exits? I guess I had to not be in the air, I guess. Yeah, thanks, game. Uh, Alright, go up real quick. Press up yet again and get our ass over here. Make this arduous climb again. Alright. So yeah, this I would like to really say this place has been 
up in the difficulty again, especially since these guys can fucking murder me in like two hits if they really wanted to. Jeez. Oh well, at least we're kicking ass. I think I found some use for the up jab, like right there, where those fucking bats just flying down and trying to kill me. Alright, so I'm gonna jump up over here. And hopefully it'll lead me to another, or lead me further into this place. Oh, this is definitely looking good. Is this a hot spring? Thank God, game. I'm starting to read your mind now. Okay, probably have to wait until this turns red so I can leap the hell out of here. Nice. Okay, so we got... So I'm guessing there's more door madness in this place. Jeez. Damn, looks pretty interesting at least. Ah, uh, how the fuck do I... Ah, damn it. I'm guessing the moon switch is involved with that shit. Well, how the fuck do I get that? Ah, damn it. Hmm. Well, let's see. Maybe I can... Maybe it involves doing all this shit. Let's try it. Alright, if I can get the fuck up there, damn. Ah, uh, oh, damn it. There's probably something important up there, too. So I need Aqua, and I don't really need fucking Sunstone, of course. That, that's just a little... That's just for the people that want to just jump over there normally. Alright. Keep an eye out for that legendary axe, which is apparently near the boss room's door, or boss man's door. It's over here. What is this all about? You'll need the legendary axe to fight the boss. Oh, really? The treasure box is hidden in the top floor of the pyramid. Okay, thanks for letting me know. Okay, I'm guessing this could be leading to the boss, and holy crap, this place looks dangerous. Okay, that's safe. I don't really need to duck here. Though I have to wonder what the fuck do I need, or how the fuck do I get back now? If I just happen to, well, maybe this will lead, next will lead me back. Oh, whoa. Uh, what the fuck? What kind of bullshit is that? Oh, like, oh, I'll just drop your ass on an enemy. Lose 90, or like, a fucking heart there almost. Shit. Fucking enemies. Alright, maybe something over here. Okay. Hmm. Oh shit. Fuck! Uh, I really need to find that aqua stone. And here's... Oh boy, this again? Man, I really need to figure out what those are for. I really need to stop doing that too. Let's just commit suicide by jumping on red, red trampoline-like blocks when the, at the worst possible moment. Jeez. Man. Okay, let's see. I f really feel like I would like to go back to Puka Puka right now, to be honest. Alright, let's go back real quick so we can hit that damn uh, Aqua Switch, because apparently, if I want to get that block up top, I'm going to have to. Well, sort of. I don't know if I really need to. Does this lead me anywhere? Of course not. Yeah, fuck you too, buddy. Alright. Let's kill all these enemies real quick. And make a dazzling leap oh, over these guys. Sweet. Very sweet. Okay. Where would this lead me to? Oh, all right, hot spring. I kind of need that because I got fucked over by miserable enemies. Okay. All right. Let's head back here and they'll probably drop me into nowhere. Or no man's land. Or just here. Damn it. Oh well. Okay. Okay, drop down here real quick. Let's make a trip back. Of course, I have to do this shit again. Yeah, I definitely like shoveling. Alright. Yeah, that's definitely one of the most... This is probably... Yeah, I definitely can say this is one of the most annoying dungeons. Until you reach the final one, then kind of tell yourself another thing at that point. Okay, so we got that yet again. We're gonna have to get through it yet again to get to the actual exit of this place. Oh, man. Back past you completely. Oh, boy. Yeah, I'm 
definitely not in the mood to fight more enemies, unless they're right in front of me. Okay. Okay, so next time, guys, since I don't think we're gonna get much of anywhere when we get the Puka Puka, uh, we're gonna try to get that Aqua. I'm gonna get that Aqua Switch well, and then off screen, and then next time we'll start off in this place again with a. We're at the top of the pyramid getting that treasure chest. So thanks for watching, have a great day, and adios. Alright.